Welcome to our lesson on multiplying by a single digit. So we're going to use the column method to work out questions A through to G. And we'll begin with question A, where we have 35 multiplied by 5. And we'll begin with 5 times 5, which is 25. So we have 2 times and 5 units. And then we have B, 3 times 5, which is 15. So that is 5 tens added to these two, which is 7 tens and the 100. So 35 times 5, 175. Question B, 254 multiplied by 7. Again, we've written it in the column method. So we have 4 times 7, which is 28, 2 tens and 8 units. Now we can do 5 times 7 which is 35 and we'll add on the 2 so that's 37 3 hundredths 7 tenths and finally 2 times 7 which is 14 add the 3 which is 17 so we have 7 hundredths and 1000 so 1778 we'll move on to question C so 3.58 multiplied by 6. Before we begin the calculations, we'll line up the decimal point. So 8 hundredths multiplied by 6 is 4 tenths and 8 hundredths, 48, or not 0.48. And then 5 times 6 is 30, add the 4, it's 34. We'll carry with 3, we'll keep the 4. And 3 times 6... Here is 18, and the 3 is 21, so 1 unit and 2 tens. So 21.48. Do you want to try and work out question E, F and G? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So for question E, we have 0 0.36 times 9. We'll begin by lining up the decimal point. 6 times 9 is 54, which is... 4 hundredths and 5 tenths. 3 times 9 is 27, and for 5, which is 32, so 3 units and 2 tenths. And 0 times 9 is 0, and for 3, which is 3 units. So 3.24. And for question F, how many hours are there in 8 days? Well, there are 24 hours in a day, so 24 multiplied by 8. 4 times 8 is 32, so 3 times and 2 units. 2 times 8 is 16, add for 3, which is 19. So that would be 9 times and 100. So there are 192 hours. And finally for question G, a Blu-ray costs £14.47. How many would 8 cost? So we have 14.47 multiplied by 8. We'll line up the decimal point. 7 times 8 is 56. 5 tenths, 6 hundredths. 4 times 8 is 32. Add the 5 is 37. So 3 units, 7 tenths. 4 times 8 is 32. Add the 3 is 35. So 3 and 5 units and then 1 times 8 is 8 added to the 3 is 11 so 110 and 100 so 115 pound 76 pence okay thank you for watching and i hope you found that useful thanks again and take care